Another thing that I wanted to touch upon, the responsibility of the family members, especially the female family members, uh, in, emo in offering emotional support and advice to a uh, young mother, especially yeah. for the first time during her pregnancy, and Absolutely. to be very, very mindful of what you are saying in front of her. Absolutely. If somebody has had a bad experience, keep it to yourself Absolutely. and do not terrorize her. Yes. Tell us about that. Um, you see, uh, those pay people who are fortunate enough to be amongst joint families and having relatives around mm. are actually very fortunate. Mm. It's just a few women who thrive, or, um, few family members who thrive on scaring the new mothers mm. to be. Mm. Most of the people. Maybe they're doing it subconsciously as well. They're not really. Uh, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> They're not really paying I attention so. to the fact that, you know. <laughs> I don't know. I think they, they get some joy out of it <laughs> okay. or something. I hope not. Right. But um, but still, most of the advice is good advice. Right. And most of the people are very encouraging and mm. supportive and tell the girls about their good experiences mm. as well. I think in the West, the girls are a little unfortunate. Then They must attend the, uh, the classes that mm. would prepare them because they need the support. Mm. Right? Mm. And they need the good stories, yeah. the encouragement. Right. So, um, you know, what, what should women be sort of, you know, what, what sort of an environment should be, they be promoting at home? Uh, the family members, especially, you know, the aunts, the mother, the sisters. And Nurturing, whatever. loving, yeah, lots yeah. of TLC. Yeah. They, they, uh, I feel that we start to criticise a bit more and start to be a bit more, that, you know. Exactly, that's why I'm stressing again and again, lots of love, lots yeah, of Yeah, care. especially if there's a daughter involved, you'll be, because you're being protective, Mm -hmm. Maybe that's the reason behind it. You're a bit m harder on her. You don't do this, don't do this. Oh, you're not looking after yourself. You're not doing this. You're not doing but still comes from a nurturing perspective, I guess. Mm. The but it's not <laughs> going to be perceived as a nurturing, is uh, it? it? There has to be a balance, just as in everything else. I mean, right. of course, we would never encourage a woman to lift a heavy weight in pregnancy, mm. right? So, mm. uh, but being so, uh, so careful that she's not allowed to touch anything, mm. That uh, also is not good for not her. Not good. The balance is there. But I think when everything is being done in good faith, mm. the girls are very sensitive at that stage. Yeah. So they should enjoy the pampering. Yeah. Rather than uh, just, just take, go and with the And sort flow. of understand that who's coming from what there, angle, yes. you know. And sometimes a person is so concerned that yeah. they'll actually maybe be harsher a bit or, or be a bit more, you know. Uh, or overly caring, yeah. irritatingly caring. Irritatingly Most caring. Most girl, an educated girl mm. who's read something entirely different mm. online mm. is told by an elder in the family to do something else. Mm. When they come and ask me, I tell them, if it's going to harm you, mm. listen to them. Mm. Ask me, mm. I'll tell you if yes. it's harmful. Absolutely. But if they're asking you to lie down, do this, mm. not do this. If it's it not, because they care. Yes, if it's yeah. not harming you, yes, absolutely. then just listen to them and enjoy right. your time. Right. Dr. Dehmina Rahman, thank you so much for being with us here today on today's program. So much to talk about and, um, you know, unfortunately running out of time. But the advice you've given is really, really important. We've been able to discuss all the nitty gritty and all those things that many people have been confused about. We will be having you on the show again where we will talk about the health challenges of a modern woman. But until then, thank you so much for being today's guest. Thank you.